Awesome. Good evening, everyone. Uh, my name is Phil Mango. I'm going to be sharing with you why I'm so excited about the 2023 convention, uh, One Plexus Convention in Nashville. More importantly, the convention contest that was announced over the weekend and it started uh, January 1. Before I do that, um, I'm going to ask our Diamond Up line, Rainy, to unmute and say hello and anything that she wants to share before we get rocking and a rolling. Hello, hello, everyone. I am so excited, number one, to hear from Phil. So thank you, Phil and Jen, for initiating um, what you guys do. One of the things you guys do so well, and that is to break down this contest, which can seem like a huge elephant, but in reality, it's one of the easiest contests we've had to earn, but you have to be in action and you have to be in activity and we have to have fun while we do it. So I can't wait to hear from you, Phil and Jen, for all of the tips and advice, and then for us to put our brains together on how are we as a team going to earn as much as we can so we can celebrate together while we're at convention. Awesome. Thank you, Rainy. Um, so let's just jump into this uh, as quickly as possible. So the Plexus One Convention, if you don't know already, it's taking place in Nashville, Tennessee in 2023, June, I believe it's 16th, which is the day after my birthday, um, through the 19th, I believe. But regardless, it's in June and we're excited. Um, let's start with why. Um, why do you want to earn the convention contest and everything that there is to offer? Number one, whenever there's something offered for doing what you normally do for free, get it. So Plexus is incentivizing, incentivizing us to earn prizes, earn a lot of cash. I'm going to show you here in a minute. And it's all for doing what we're already doing. So always take advantage of that. Number two, there are always promotions, promotions, excuse me, there are always promotions during contests. Why not you? And when I say promotions, I'm talking about rank advancements. Every year, there are stories of people who, because of the convention contest, achieved a rank, two ranks, a whole new level. Jen, I know, reached Emerald at her first convention um, in 2014. So um, why not us? Number three, your sustainable business comes becomes more sustainable through growth and activity. It's no um, secret that as we get in the holiday season that we tend to see our businesses shrink a little bit. And with the new year um, and new focus, this is a great time to turn our businesses back on that hockey stick curve back up. And these first four months are usually the best ones to do so. So by having a contest that we're focused on, it helps our sustainable business. I know Randy loves this one. Plexus parties at convention are historically some of the best parties you'll go to. How many people prior to Plexus had ever gone to a silent disco? Not me. How many people have been to a silent disco since and like it's one of your favorite things to do? So um, we love it. And then lastly, because eggs, gas, and milk are not getting any cheaper. I mean, uh, I had asked my wife, how much are eggs uh, normally? And, and I was shocked to hear that they're essentially triple the price, right? So those things are getting even cheaper, which means people need income, which means people uh, are looking for ways to earn extra income, and we can provide that. Okay, so that's our why. Oh, thank you. Let people in the room. And admitting, and admitting, and admitting. Okay, cool. So if you want to play, you need to know the rules. First off, this contest uh, started retroactively January 1st, and it runs through April 30th. We've had convention contests in the past that only ran 90 days, I believe. Um, so this one's going the full four months. So I'm excited about that. You must be commission qualified. So that means $100 of your own PV or $100 running through your account to uh, earn uh, these prizes. And you must be registered and attend convention in 2023 to earn the prizes. Here's the great thing. You can register all the way up until June 15th. I don't recommend it, uh, but as long as there's registration still available, 
you'll be able to register for convention. So if you wanted to tip your uh, dip your toes in the water, really push to make um, this contest as big as possible and earn as much as you can, and then register, you could do that according to the rules that I've read through. So don't let that be a way or a distraction from earning all these prizes saying, well, I'm not even registered. Go with the mindset of, let me see how much I can earn and then register. That's okay too. Registration closed on the 15th. So give it a shot. All right, next. What are we playing for? So we know the why. We know the rules that we need to play by. What are we playing for? 300 points gets you a $50 convention store uh, credit. 600 points gets you a $100 travel voucher. 900 gets you a $200 Plexus One, a, a credit card, kind of like a Visa card or an Amex card that you get as a gift. 1,200 points for winner's dinner. 1,500 points for a $500 travel cash. 2,000 points for $7,500 travel cash. Uh, 2,500 points for 1,000 in spending money. And then lastly, Black Tie Gala. Let me tell you something really cool that I read and I learned. The first 1,000 people who earn the 1,200 points will get winner's dinner. Everyone after that will earn $700. So if you don't get winner's dinner because you're not the, one of the first 1,000, as a consolation prize, you're getting $700 in cash. So just so you know, the $100 travel voucher, uh, the 500 cash, the 750 and the 1,000 cash gets paid to you the week after commissions in May. So May the 22nd or thereabouts will be when you get all of those cash prizes, including if you earn winner's dinner and actually don't get a seat, you're going to get your $700. Guess what Black uh, Tie Gala? It's the first 250 winners. If you're not one of the first 250, you're getting $1,100. That's an expensive dinner. I've been to some fancy dinners with my bride. I don't know that I've been to an $1,100 a plate dinner. And I want to go. Don't get me wrong. I want to put on the tux. I want to be there. But if I'm number 252 or 251 and they're giving me 1100 okay. So <laughs> if you um, don't, uh, if you earn those things, but you're after the cutoff, FYI, do the math. That's a hundred. Um, excuse me, a hundred dollars in travel, five hundred seven fifty. So that's thirteen fifty. A thousand. That'd be twenty six. Or excuse me, twenty. Yep. Hold on. Twelve fifty. Fourteen. Fifteen fifty. Uh, twenty three fifty. Three thousand fifty. That would be forty four fifty in cash you would get on the 22nd of May. Did, can anyone use 4450 in cash? Okay. So by the way, I looked at previous contests. Does anybody know what it used to be for earning the Black Tie Gala? How many points? Any guesses? Rainy. Yeah, it was upwards of 4,500 points to earn. Yeah. So it's a lot less points. Now, let's talk about those points. So how do we score? This contest is all about getting VIP customers with welcome packs to join. So VIP customers with welcome packs. This is a growth contest. There are two categories to earn points, sign-up credits and prize credits. We're only going to focus on sign-up credits, and I'm going to tell you why. Prize credits are when your level ones through four earn some of the prizes that are going to come out every month or earn some of the prizes in the contest. Two of your people in each category, level one, level two, level three, and level four. Oh, thank you. She's telling me to add people again. Sorry. One second. Nope, there's no one to add. Okay. So two people can earn. Uh, a max of two people in your downline can earn you prize credits. So the prize credits are capped at about 220 credits. That's great. That's wonderful. If you're growing, you're going to earn those in addition to what I'm about to show you. We're going to focus only on the growth because that's where the majority of the points are going to come from. 
the points breakdown is pretty simple. Um, when an ambassador signs up, they're automatically starting with 20 points. Okay, so I might have wrote this a little bit differently, but you're going to see the math here in just a second. So when ambassador signs up, they automatically get 20 points. Everyone that you sign up as a level one is worth 15 points. Uh, the level twos are worth 10. The level threes and level fours are worth five points each. So let's do a quick exercise. All right. And uh, you can buzz in. I'm going to try a little annotate tool because that's fun. I want to draw. Bang. All right. So looking over here, Jen signs up Amy, a VIP customer with a welcome pack. Amy is Jen's level one. How many points does Jen get for Amy when she signs up with a welcome pack? 15. Bang. 15. Ooh, that's a little bit thick. I'm going to change that annotation to here. I will say 15 points. Isn't Dang. it 20? 20 is for, the way that I read this is that 20 points is for ambassadors, not the brand ambassador. Um, they do it without. Yeah, is 20 points. So I'm, I'm reading this as level ones are worth 15, twos are 10, level threes and fours are five oh, each. Maybe you're looking at me funny because we went through this together. Okay, cool. No, I don't agree. It says with a welcome pack. With a welcome pack was 20 points. Brand ambassador is 20 point, 20 cent of credits. A level one brand, uh, brand ambassador is 15. That's confusing. It is. So we're going to stick with 15. Good? Okay, good. All right, now, so Amy got us 15 points. Amy signs up Sarah and Jessica with the same welcome packs. Jen gets how many points? So these would, these would be level twos, and there's two of them. So how many points? I'm hurting some people's math brains. So she got 15 points up here for a level one. Sarah signed up two people. That's 10 points each, so Jen gets 20 points, okay? We're moving down a level. So remember Jessica from up here? Jessica signs up Robin and Tammy. And Amy, who's a level uh, two, signs up Brenda and Jane. Jen gets how many points now? I'm going to help you all out because everyone's confused. I'm going to put a five, five, a five, right there, and a five. So Jen gets now 20 points from these level threes. Finally, Jane signs up four with welcome packs. Jen gets how many? Four times five is 20. Okay. We add it all up from this activity. That's 60, uh, excuse me, 75 points. So, so far she'd have 75 points. Okay. That's how the math is working. Make sure there's no one else that needs to be let in. Okay, good. So this will make a lot more sense when I show you the next uh, couple slides here. Okay. So how do we win? Oh, now I've got to erase all that. Sorry. I'm going to stop you again. And I want to make, because I think this is important. The chart that was shared from, from corporate shows that you, everyone you sign up with sign up credits gets 20 credits. If there are a level one signing up people, then it's 15 credits. That's I think that's a big difference. And Rainey, you can correct me if I'm wrong, but I think the way I'm reading it from what we've been shared with from graphics is that it's 20. That's the way I'm reading it, but I just, uh, here's, here's the deal then. Like what I love about this is that we're looking, let's, our way we're seeing it, Jen, that's best case scenario, right? Right. But even with these numbers, it's still showing, it's still like, he's showing it's so doable. So if, yeah. right, how we're seeing it is the way it goes, then the cool it's thing is, is that we're that much more ahead. Yep. Agreed. So here's how we win. 
we sign up a minimum of three VIP, v, yeah, three VIP customers a month with a welcome pack. We teach the power of three and we activate it using a few different techniques that we'll talk about in a little bit. We plug them into our team page. We create, manage, and drive, as well as maintain a culture of growth. It doesn't matter what we did last month. It doesn't matter what we did last year. It really doesn't matter what we did seven years ago. It only matters about what we do today and moving forward. And if we want a culture of growth, we just have to start tonight with that. And we have to start tomorrow and, and continue and drive it, maintain it. And then we duplicate. So um, I'm going to show you now. Um, before we go to how we do it next, I'm going to pull something else up that I created that I'm going to share with you all um, on the team page. I'm going to get rid of my annotation tool. Go back to my mouse. Okay. So I created um, a convention contest potential. Um, now, I use the 15 points. If we're completely convinced that it's 20, then this math looks even better. Okay. But right now it's got 15. So I want someone other than Rainy and Jen um, to just tell me um, between one and 10, uh, wherever you're currently sitting at, um, how many people you intend and maybe it's 20, how many VIP customers or welcome packs you want to sign up this month? First person, pick a number. There are no wrong answers. Can I phone a friend? <laughs> I'm going to say three, three a month. Oh, three, great. Okay, now, what I've done over here is, is automatically, all you do is you fill in the green boxes and everything else takes care of itself. So up here, assuming it's, I'll change it if it's 20, but right now I've got is 15 points, okay? Now, let's be conservative and let's just say you get what's called the power of one, which essentially means that one out of three actually duplicates, actually grows at the pace that you want them to grow, okay? So I changed this power to power of one. Okay, so if you can get three this much, month and teach them to duplicate and only one out of the three actually picks this up, you'll still get 105 points. But I want you to notice this column, this row down here, okay? That's the effect of your pay points. By having three people sign up and only having the power of one, you increase your pay points by 60. Okay, that's just for January. Um, somebody else, tell me what you would want to get um, in the month of love, the month of February. Come on, Jed Mango, go ahead. Give me a number. Four. Okay. With the power of one, your points for the contest increase to 140, as well as, interestingly enough, your pay points. So you go from 60, uh, assuming all these people stick around for three months or more, to 140 points. You've literally gone from an ambassador to a gold ambassador in 45 days. Okay, um, let's see. Somebody else shout out a number for March. Let's go with six. Six, okay. Again, if only the with the power of one, you're now, you've gotten 210 points in March and you've increased your pay points to 260. So you've gone from an ambassador to a senior gold ambassador, okay? And, and let's then, just- Bill, what, yeah. what if we bring that back down to three and just see? Great. You got 105 points and you still increased your, your you're still a senior, uh, senior gold ambassador in 320 points. So your total points is 560 for the contest. Let me show you where this gets fun, okay? That's the power of one. Watch this. What happens when we teach the power of three and we're passionate and excited about it and we get everyone to sit there and go, when you join, find three friends, find three people, put them on a three-way call with me, whatever system works, 
and let's get them to join and let's teach them the same thing. Look what happens. You go from one person, okay? This is why the power of three has worked for this company for 12 years to literally becoming a almost a senior Ruby and 900 points. If we just take that and go, I'm going to try and get two people every month. We are almost an Emerald ambassador. Now, if I could teach the power of three and sign up three people, we've now literally won everything in the contest. And more importantly, look at our, look where we're at. We're all emeralds. We're all emeralds. And this is based on 15 points, not on the 20 points that Jen uh, believes. And as I'm looking at this uh, sheet, she's probably right, as she always is. Um, it's just a little bit confusing in the actual documentation versus the chart. So um, when I change that, the numbers will be even significantly greater. So can we all sit there and try and get three people and then teach them to do the same? I mean, is that, I know it's hard, but is it like digging a ditch hard? No. Is it like lifting heavy weights for two hours at a gym hard? Or is it just hard because I got to actually get out of my own head and get in front of people and like convince them that these products and this system and this comp plan is the best thing ever, right? So I'm going to give you this tracker so you can play with it. Um, the thing I want to share with you is what do we do next? Number one, we set a dream goal. Um, Jen and I tease each other or she teases me because I'm dying to get a tuxedo. Like I'm looking for an excuse to get a tuxedo. And for years, it's been to go to a black tie gala from Plexus. So I'm setting a goal to get there um, and to go there. And so that's where I'm pushing. I want 3,000 plus points, plain and simple. And if I don't get to go to the gala, I'm going to get four, you know, potentially $4,000, which, which I'll take the tux and I'll wear it somewhere in Nashville. I don't care. Um, use the tools that we have. Um, the sharing tools, the share the link tool, all the things that we've got to make this thing automated so we can run a business from our phone, we need to use those tools. Um, and then this is maybe most important. We want to look for daily, weekly, and monthly wins. We have a long-term goal, right? But every day, we just need to find a win. And that win might be, um, I made 10 calls today. I, I sent three messages today. I had one conversation today. Whatever that goal is, set yourself uh, set yourself up for success by having some small wins. Never quit. I think we've said this enough, and there's enough people on this call who've been with us for many years know that the way that you win is by not quitting. And that someday, whether that's today in this contest or another contest, you will win as long as you don't quit. So never quit. And then lastly, enjoy this process um, because it's fun. It's fun to get engaged and to reach people. And, and more importantly, I want to share this with you. When people know that you have a goal and that you have something you're pushing for, they want to run with you. They want to hop in your boat. They want to be on that journey. So let them, let them be a part of it. Um, and we'll celebrate many great successes on May 1st and have an amazing party in Nashville uh, in June. So with that, I will pause. I think there's a bunch in the chat. I didn't check for any questions, but I'll ask uh, now, are there any questions? And I remember silence is acceptance. Um, I'll just say, I just want to remind you and give you permission to remind others on your team. If you have people that have already signed up and are committed to going to convention, 
it's it's kind of like a it's a I don't want to say they're dumb if you don't try, but why would you not try to get some of your money back for your, your trip? Right. So even if they're like, well, I've been working this business and nobody has responded and nobody's on my team anymore and nobody, 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 if you're committed to going, you might as well try to recoup some of your cost. And guess what will happen? The action of inviting people and getting a new customer or getting another ambassador will be the momentum that pushes you to the next yes. So no matter what you feel like in this moment, myself included, of being maybe tired, don't think about today as much as you need to think about May 1st or thinking about being in Nashville, which you've already paid for, you're starting to pay for, you're planning for, and be committed that way and approach your teams in that same manner. We're going to have fun. Why not earn some extra spending cash? And if it's overwhelming to think about earning the gala, don't set that as your goal. Set your goal is winning $150. Yeah. And then once you do that, then you change your goal when the contest, if the contest isn't over. So I'm going to fix the tracker. I'm going to adjust the scores um, and you'll see how much easier it is to even get there um, with the power of three. But it felt so doable with your numbers, Phil. And that's why I love seeing them from, from that viewpoint, because you know that Five, an extra five points on each or that first level makes a huge difference. And so seeing, I mean, I'm excited seeing what I saw tonight, much less with the added increase that, you know, we know is now there. So that's awesome. And I hope everyone else feels some inspiration from this. And like Jen said, you know, it's okay to have been tired, but now is the time to decide, okay, either I'm a quitter or I'm not a quitter. And we're not quitters. And it's time to dig in, set a goal, and go for it. Now, Bill, do you mind if I share a little sneak peek of something that's coming? Please do. Okay, so we talked about getting people plugged in and getting them to be excited about the process and plugging them into systems and duplicating. So it's coming for our team in February. Details are still being ironed out about when you show up, you get the sneak peek of what's coming. I have teamed up with seven other diamonds and we are going to host a weekly real people, real results, Plexus testimonies. So remember back 10 years ago when we had the dial-in calls where you listened and you were inspired by stories of people that were finding success, whether it was on the health side or the business side with Plexus. Well, we're going to do that, but we're going to do it in a Zoom chat room, and we're going to be connected with seven other teams. So what I love about that is that there's strength in numbers that you'll be able to plug in twice a week, y'all. So there'll be a live on Thursdays and then a recording of that previous Thursday's event. So if they missed it on Thursday, there's always something to plug your new person into. If they're a VIP customer, that's the first thing you want to invite them to is to hear stories of belief. So that's coming. Our target goal is to get that started on February 9th. And February 2nd, we will have a training on just how will I invite people to this? What will this look like? But because you're here, I wanted to tell you about it tonight. And that will just be a tool to help you tap into this contest and earn your max. Awesome. Thank you for sharing, Rainy. Um, again, uh, I'll say this. Just keep it simple. Three, power of three. Go back to the basics. This whole contest is about getting VIP customers with welcome packs. Um, when you're duplicating and you're in that kind of momentum, all the prizes will be bonus. The, the prize credits will be bonus. Um, but if you focus on growth, your business will benefit greatly and your uh, contest points will benefit uh, equally as well. Awesome. Thank you all for letting us share. I'm going to pause the recording. <laughs>